Hey, how's it going, you guys? Um, I'm making a video on uh, mapping an external hard drive with music onto your Serato, so to be able to search it, because it's not what I'm about to do is not really too hard, but I, I didn't find any videos on YouTube on how to do it, so I'm basically just gonna do one myself. But um, it's just like, say you you keep only a, um, a certain kind of music or a certain kind of songs or whatever and you keep them in your computer and then you have like say uh, classic rock or whatever say you have a gig where you need a bunch of music and um, so you take an external hard drive right like this one so then that's what I do I take an external hard drive and then the problem is that when I go to search and do stuff like that the way I was using it was just like this free agent 2010 Mac music and then here's all my stuff but the only problem is I, if I needed to find a song, I couldn't do it. So what I'm about to do is, like I said, it's not anything too hard, but I, I just couldn't find anything on YouTube, which is just crazy. But here we go. So I just open file and like see over here, I have my regular music. It's all the stuff that I normally play. And then I have all this. So I just grab it and I drag it onto the where you keep all your crates or whatever and now it starts to look at everything and it'll start you know loading everything now this takes a while so if you have a million music like if you have a million songs it's gonna take a while so I'm gonna turn it off for now and then we'll see and then so yeah alright guys so it's done loading and everything all the stuff that it needs to do um, we can now find it under the crates as 2010 Mac music and here it opens up the file and then that's where I keep all my songs you can pretty much it, it listen by songs I don't really bother too much with them um, changing it to listen by artist or whatever because really I just use I just like to use the search bar and then so now I type in whatever I, I need to find on my external hard drive let's say I type in um, yeah and make sure that 2010 is clicked off or you have it under all because then it'll look through all your crates so let's see now we do now that that's loaded and if you really want to I guess you could uh, build the overviews to where it um, tries to figure out all the stuff about the file and all everything and uh, I don't bother doing that because it takes too it just takes too long and then and I don't really it, I don't really need it it'd be good to have it of course but it just takes too long so anyways um, now that I click on 2010 Mac music all the songs come up say I have a certain track on this one and I'm like oh you know this song would sound really good with it so now you're like okay sweet child of mine type it in sorry there buddy uh, sweet child of mine I type it in it comes up right here I, I guess I have them in two different places there's uh, this one and then there's this one so whichever one grab it load it up and there we go and now I don't have the overview or anything but it doesn't really matter I mean of course it'd be better to have it it just takes too long so yeah that's pretty much what I do that's pretty much how I do it so any comments would be appreciated. Um, I'm trying to get better at making the video, so hopefully I'll have more about different kind of things. So just check back in. Thank you.